Uh, so I'm writing a feature on you this week uh, for the Thresher. Um, so I'm just going to ask you a few questions. Um, it seemed like the ball was really flowing, flowing well tonight. Uh, you were hitting the three ball really well. Can you talk about that? Yeah, our team was really excited to be home. Um, really came together and we've been focused on making the extra pass and one more pass to our teammate to get an open shot and a better shot and just went in tonight. So it was really good. Um, and can you talk about when you first started playing basketball and when you think you first started taking it really seriously? Oh, goodness. Um, I started playing in first grade and my dad coached me. Uh, we are on the team called the Monkey Girls, so it was a very fun league. Um, probably in like seventh grade, I was like, I want to play in college. Uh, I joined a club or travel team and that's what got me here to Rice, so it's been a fun journey. Mm -hmm. And uh, what's your major in Rice and what are your plans for after Rice? Yeah, my major is Computational and Applied Math. Uh, and then I'm also double majoring with Regular Math, so that's been pretty cool. And then after Rice, I plan to go to graduate school. So still waiting to hear back from a few more, but I've already been accepted, so I'm going for sure. <laughs> okay, great. And you guys are 9-4 and four right now in conference play. Um, what would it mean to you to finish your senior season with possibly winning a conference tournament? Yeah, I mean, that would mean the world. That's every basketball player's goal. Um, but, I mean, we're focused on one game at a time and just loving my teammates as much as I can through the process, so it's good. Um, and what are some things you do off the court to relax um, and outside of the classroom, outside of the basketball court? Um, well, I like to watch movies, <laughs> um, Netflix. Um, I like to do crafts sometimes, uh, if I have the time, so, little um, things. And has this season matched your expectations? Has it gone above expectations um, that you had at, at prior to the season? Um, it's probably exceeded my expectations. Um, I mean, I know this team is always capable, and it's really fun to see how far we've come since we first started playing together and uh, working hard in the summer, so... It's definitely been good, and it's exciting to see how much we've clicked. Okay, great. Thank you. Got two questions. One, after having a season that you all had last year to finish, how much was that a carryover into the offseason and preparing for this, this season? Yeah, it was definitely a confidence booster uh, winning the championship. Um, we did know we lost a few key components on our team, so we were kind of wondering uh, how we would switch carrying over to the next year. Um, but it also showed us that like we can go to bigger tournaments, the WNIT or the NCAA, and having those as goals in mind has definitely been uh, a bigger, led to more achievements from our team, so it's been fun. And one last question. Nicole mentioned about, uh, you always mentioned to her about numbers, talked to her about numbers before the game. What is that about? What does that ar arise from? Um, I think it was Gabby. Yeah, yeah, Gabby. Yeah, so Ga Gabby just I'm told sorry. Nicole how many threes to hit tonight. She just said some wild number. Uh, just trying to get everyone on the team's confidence up. Uh, we don't always shoot when we're open, so we're trying to make sure we just let the ball fly and shoot confidently. Being a long senior on this squad, you're pretty much the glue that holds it all together. Uh, do you feel like that or it just comes to you naturally? Yeah, I don't really feel like that. I feel like it's definitely a team effort. Um, team's obviously relational, so I just do my best to get to know everyone and uh, make sure that chemistry is still there. Thank you. Thank you all so much. Thank you.